uh, I think it's still worth playing Times Attack even if you've gone to the end. It's a very cool interactive way to learn the times tables and you basically go all around the virtual world. Uh, you defeat the guards and monsters and robots by successfully answering math problems, otherwise they will shoot you. You'll see four little snails crawling around the room and then first you have to collect each snail you throw them at the door and the numbers are played again to make sure you remember them. As there become more and more factors to the multiplication problem, there are more and more creatures crawling or flying all around. You Then, then the problem appears on the door and you type it in and it, if you succeed, the, you'll hear this um, ding ding ding, something like that noise. Then the door will open. I will walk the guard or monster or robot and you defeat him by repeating that problem and others you've learned earlier through this system and and you have to repeat every problem on the times table and if you get it wrong you go back to the ones that you got wrong do them again then return to him and eventually you defeat him and move on to the next times table it's a, it's a very fun very interactive very puzzles it's one of those puzzle solving worlds that both daddy and I love because the puzzles really make you use your brain the company really does live up to its big brains name at the start, it's really mind-twisting, but eventually it becomes routine and you learn your times tables in a very fun way. In the dungeon world, there's so many strange corridors and stairs and chambers and jail cells, and it can get a little bit confusing. In the machine world, there are all sorts of mind-tickling contraptions that you have to solve the puzzles of, and in the lava world, there are flamethrowers and lava pits and dragons that you have to get around, and it's really cool walking through a virtual world to learn your times tables rather than looking down at text. When you're playing Times Attack, does it feel like you're sitting still in a chair? No. Uh, probably even even though I've, I've started to grow out of that stage, who have an incredible amount of difficulty sitting still, probably they'll forget all about their real body, and they'll, they'll be so absorbed in this world where they could go anywhere, do almost anything. Battle the creatures of of uh, mythology or battle cool futuristic take over the world type robots. Martin Luther King Jr. referred to breaking the chains of segregation, a very dramatic figure of speech. In this Times Attack game they also use a figure of speech. They depict you as locked up in the dungeon of ignorance and you have to escape stage by stage by memorizing the various times tables. Numbers get more and more challenging of course, it was confusing when I was younger, but still, certain times tables that I have trouble in, like the sixes or the or the um, twelves or something big like that, 